local nonprofit organization is hosting a fashion forward event to help celebrate first responders. So this morning, I want to introduce you guys to attorney Sylvia Reed and Jessamar Ewart to learn more about Gateway to Life's fashion fundraiser. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So excited to have you guys here. Yes. Uh, so first up, uh, attorney Sylvia, now for people who are not familiar with the Gateway to Life organization, can you tell me more about how you all serve the community? Yes, we are Gateway to Life. We deal with domestic violence prevention um, by providing some media um, conferences, bringing attention and awareness to to prevent domestic violence, elder abuse, and b domestic bullying. Mm-hmm, okay, mm -hmm. all right. Now, um, you guys are having a fashion show yes. to help kind of pay it forward to Middletown first responders. Yes. What can people expect at the fashion show? Well, um, it's gonna be in Middletown at the beautiful ballroom of the BPO Elks um, Lodge. And it's this Sunday, November 3rd, and we are going to be recognizing those first responders. The, there are towns that have domestic violence units at their police departments. Middletown is one of those um, um, departments that has a domestic violence prevention uh, unit. Um, Portland is small, so it, we're just going to be recognizing the police officers from Portland and the EMTs who volunteer their time to help so many people and at any time, day and night, any emergency, they are available. And I think it's very fitting in light of losing two wonderful volunteer police, uh, firefighters this past mm -hmm. week. And so mm -hmm. I want to have as many people there while they are alive to say, you know, we appreciate you. We thank you for your service. Um, not just, you know, if something bad happen we want to do it now right mm -hmm. right our real life heroes every real day life every day if they have yes. to wear a bulletproof vest to work they need more than just a paycheck absolutely now Jessamar, we know yeah. you are involved in the fashion <laughs> world right. so tell us how you're putting your special touch on this event yeah so you know i love to give back as you know and um, with this show um sylvia reached out i'm like sure why not so last season as i came on i talk about my debut of my clothing line so jmar so I'll be debuting that, well, not debuting it, but showcasing that mm -hmm. at our fashion show, giving back to those folks as well. So um, under the supervision of Wayne Winston, he will be directing um, the whole fashion show. So a bunch of us, uh, including one of my favorite, uh, Craig, will be showcasing there as well. So I'm excited to help Sylvia with this effort. So yes. fashion is everything to me and sure, of course as well as um, giving back so yes. I'm excited. And there will also be some performances. Oh my goodness. Dinner. Yes. Drinks. Yes. A lot of fun. A good time. Yes. And it, um, Jubilee is a local reggae artist. He will be performing. Um, Chelsea Pollard, she does theatrical um, performances. She will be singing and it's just going to be awesome and we want everybody to buy tickets right away because we need a head count for food. <laughs> uh, um, um, it's going to be a lot of good food. Um, the Elks cook, he is, they are great. The cooks over there are mm -hmm. phenomenal so they are going to be providing the food. Awesome. Okay. Now, where can people get their tickets? They can go to our website, www.gatewaytolife.org. Not .com, .org. Okay. <laughs> Gatewaytolife.org. All right. Thank you so much for joining us this morning, and I hope you guys have a great turnout. Thank I you. hope so, too. Thank you yes. so much.